This movie review is for Valerian and the City of a Thousand Planets. We know the director Luke Besson loves his visuals and watching the trailers leading up to the film I actually expected that this could have a lot of similarities to Avatar but that is just a poor very extremely poor comparison because this movie is not even close to what avatar is this movie i feel like the visuals it's what's worth watching here i don't think it's the actor's fault in my opinion we got a great cast here the story on its own oh my god there's no depth to any of these characters the romantic tale told in this story is uh hollow i enjoyed it for what it was this was nothing but a big cheese puff i think that luke besson is a phenomenal phenomenal styling visual director but he is a director that's a hit or miss when it comes to a story being told we know his track record he does know how to put on a good film i felt disappointed walking out of the theater because i had my hopes set high for this film just because the trailers itself did a great job promoting it this is a film intended for a younger audience i'm 27 years old so maybe i just don't get it maybe this is that little teenage pop feel still I i'm not sure but I usually tend to gravitate towards those films if done right. And this is a movie that could have been done right, it seems like, just because of the premise. But, you know, you see you see the story when it's developing right in front of you. It's so predictable. Right from the beginning, I knew who the bad guy was. I knew what was going to happen. I just didn't get the hype for the film. I, I, don't, I don't know. It's a massive mess, in my opinion. I just wish it wasn't because I do like Luke Besson. I do like the cast that they got in this film. But it was just not executed the right way i think it was done very poorly i think that luke besson going forward should serve as a producer and bring on an actual storytelling director it's an easy watch yeah it's not too too long i think it's like two hours it's, it pushes a little bit but um it's not too too long and the visuals are stunning so it's worth a watch it's worth a 4k buy just to test out your tv maybe the graphics novel is groundbreaking but not the film itself you know the actual movie flop it was a story that i would have enjoyed had it been done just a tiny bit better i probably will be getting this film in 4k but it'll have to be at a reasonable price i don't see myself paying 20 25 dollars for this movie in 4k even if the quality of the visuals is through the roof i just can't comment down below let me know what you guys thought thanks for watching peace